All right, so I'm just gonna give you a quick video tour from the interior of the hotel. Started from my room, which is 203. The room right here, 204. They're all two stories up here on the second floor. You can see from the steps. And there are approximately four rooms up here on this side. There's 202. And here's 201. And then this is this is pretty much all we have here. This is uh, the view of the street. It's raining today. It's been raining the last couple days. It's on and off though. It's not like a uh, rain all day kind of thing. So I'm just gonna walk you over to the other side. I have a video tour of room 206, which is on this other side here. Just want to show you. Here's three different rooms on this side. Nice and dry, even though it's raining because of the ceiling here. So 206. The pool downstairs, five and a half feet on the deep end, and uh, on this side there are there are actually more rooms on this side. Three, just past three rooms, and there's another three here. And I'm assuming they're all, they're all three, they're all two stories. You see the second floor up there. So there are six rooms up here on this side a total of 10 rooms 10 10 uh, two-story apartments now i'm just gonna walk downstairs it's a nice little cozy place i kind of like it that's why i extended a couple to, uh from i want to say an additional four to five days to finish off my trip here and this is this is where the front desk is. The front desk is closed on Sundays. And today happens to be Sunday. Here's the pool. Just gonna walk around here. And next side show you show you the rooms. This is where the housekeeper resides and the staff. So there we go. Here are all uh, I guess. The, uh, the complimentary water they give each guest once they check in. So, 101. So 102. Not sure what number this room is. And 103. There are only. Hmm. There are only five rooms on the first floor. And those are all studio types. No second floor. Hey, Guya, how are you? And then this is the front gate. Let me walk you out. Holy crap, look at that. See, this is another thing you get here. And uh, you get this anywhere pretty much in the Philippines. Once, once there's heavy rain, you get a lot of flooding. And that is pretty heavy. I think it's only been raining for, I want to say about an hour. A girl was swimming for a while. Didn't, didn't seem to bother her until just a little while ago. And you can see that it's, it's getting ready to clear up. Sun's getting ready to come out. But this is, this is a mess. This is like, how do you, how do you get out of here? So, um, yeah. Another thing is that the room, the hotel offers, you only get complimentary toilet paper on the first day. And then every other day, there is no toilet paper. And each roll is 10, 10 pesos, which is very odd. And there's no housekeeping on Sundays because the front desk is off and even though the housekeeper lives on site, it's her day off. So she doesn't clean any rooms on, on Sunday. So make sure that you get your housekeeping on Saturday. And it has to be before 5. 
because if you don't get housekeeping before five then you don't get housekeeping because the housekeeper even though she lives on site she will only clean rooms up until 5 p.m which is the time that she gets off and she apparently schedules all the rooms so you have to pretty much schedule when your when your room is going to be clean i've had her see me coming outside and ask me if she can put me down for 1 p.m cleaning 1 p.m cleaning so just just a couple things to keep in mind and if you're looking for how to direct people in getting here like a trike or a guest i always tell them that it's next to prime asia and this is prime asia over here on the side i'll actually walk over this is janice apartel but i doubt people will know about Janice Apartel. So here it is, Janice Apartel. I'm just gonna walk over to Prime Asia, which looks pretty nice. You can get Prime Asia for I wanna say fifty yeah, fifty dollars a night, depending on oh, man, looks pretty nice. The entranceway is pretty nice. So I'm assuming that the, the only reason the price actually goes down that low is because well this is this I'm I'm referring to hotels.com rates. And I'm assuming that the reason the price goes down that low is because they have special offers but also because of the location. I don't think the location is a very uh is very fun for a lot of people. I don't think people like coming out this far, this out of the way, on a side street. It's kind of like this is this is where the locals are. As soon as you turn, as soon as you make that turn, that you're you're heading into Hensonville, and Hensonville is where a lot of the the locals reside. So just just giving you guys a heads up, and that's my video tour of Elysia Condo Hotel. Just. That's my review, and this is this has been on an interior video tour. Hope hope this helps you. All right, adios.